What's up guys, Mizzo Frizzo here, and in this very short tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to set up some look sensitivity and aiming sensitivity controls. I don't actually have an aim animation set up here, but if I right click up the top left you can see it says true when I right click and false when I release. So as you can see here I've got my usual sensitivity and then if I right click my sensitivity comes down and my walk speed comes down. So just like the typical setup in a traditional first person shooter I'm moving around my look sensitivity is higher and when I aim my walk speed comes down and my look sensitivity also comes down so without further ado let me show you how to do this alrighty all I've done guys is create a new project using the first person template I'm going to go into the first person folder and blueprints and open up BP first person character and in a very hacky and roundabout way, I'm just going to find the right mouse button. And I'm going to create a new variable, call it aiming question mark. And off of the right mouse button, I am going to set aiming as true. And upon release, set it as false. I'm also going to grab the character movement up here. And off of it, I'm going to find set max walk speed. You can duplicate that one. Plug the target into character movement. So when I press the right mouse button, I'm going to set the max walk speed as 150. And upon release, set it back to the default, which is 600. Okay. Next thing I'm going to do is grab everything under camera input and move it down to create some more space here. This is where we're going to set up our sensitivity controls. So first, we're going to need a few variables. Let's call the first one horizontal look sensitivity. Sensitivity of type float. We can duplicate that one. Call this one vertical look sensitivity. And we can also duplicate horizontal look sensitivity, call this one horizontal aiming sensitivity. And duplicate vertical look sensitivity, call this one vertical aiming sensitivity. You're going to have to compile that before you can set the defaults. And let's set the horizontal look sensitivity at 0.5 to start off with and the vertical look sensitivity to 0.35 and let's make the aiming sensitivity something like 0.2 and 0.1 next thing I'm going to do is I'll drag these out here and I'm just going to duplicate these ones and off of triggered I'm going to find a branch plug in aiming question mark into the branch so these are going to be our separate uh, add controller inputs depending on whether we're aiming or not so what we can do is just off of this reroute node find multiply plug it into the value here and this is when we are aiming our left and right so this will be our horizontal aiming sensitivity plug this one in here and then off of this reroute node down here also find multiply this is going to be our vertical aiming sensitivity we can also multiply it down here for our look sensitivity horizontal horizontal look sensitivity plug that one in and multiply action value y by our uh, vertical look sensitivity plug that one in there and that's it should be good to go if i hit play here i've got my usual look sensitivity and my usual walk speed and if i right click my walk speed comes down and my aiming sensitivity comes down Guys, if this has been of any use or value to you whatsoever, please hit like and subscribe, and I will see you on the next one.